I want to show you how you can add sound into a blog. Here I am within the edit screen in Glogster. I click on sound. It's going to give me three options. The option to upload a sound, to link to a sound, or grab. You want to grab your sound. However, before you do this, you want to make sure that your external microphone is plugged into your computer. You'll then click grab. It will bring up a new window for you. If you notice it's on the audio tab, you could also record video or take a photo, but we're going to focus on audio. The default setting is five minutes. You could extend that if you needed to, but we're going to leave it at about five minutes. You then simply click on record. It's going to ask you, do you want it to take over your microphone and you're going to say allow. I am then going to start recording. And if you notice over here on the right hand screen, every time I speak, there is a colored bar that appears. So I know that it's recording my voice. Once I've finished, I can simply click stop recording. You then have the option to play or stop. I'm going to click continue. And now you need to give your audio a name. So I'm going to call this audio recording for blog. But you can call it whatever you'd like. Click save. And then it's been saved to your Glockster gallery. So you can now close this window. So now when I'm ready, um, if you notice the recording appears right here. You can then add a player if you would like, which would give your um, sound a different look. You have lots of choices for players. So I'm just going to pick one that I think is fun. I'm going to change mine to a star. It's going to give you a preview and then you click use it. I can close this window. Once it is in, I have the ability to move it, edit it, just like I would any other feature of Glockster. If I would then like to preview it, I can click preview. I can then click on it and listen. And if you notice over here on the right hand screen, every time I speak, so you can see exactly how it works. If the grab feature does not work for you, you can view the next video on how to use sound with Audacity.